Hi, I'm Paul May with Equipped Expedition Outfitters, and I wanted to take a minute to talk about the accessories available for the Easy On K9 roof rack system. There's a myriad of options for the K9 rack. Uh, because of its T-slot design and, and flat platform, you can do a lot with the top of it. And I want to just show you a quick overview of what we can do with this rack. We have single jerry can holders, dual jerry can holders, a 40 liter water solution. We have a, a tire mount, high lift mount, combination axe and shovel mount, axe mount by itself, shovel mount by itself. We have Max Trax holders, uh, accessory adapters for mounting your own things on the side of the rack, as well as awning mounts for this. You can even put your Thule and Yakima towers and bars on the top of the K9 system. It's an incredibly versatile rack, allows you to move anything that you like around there, including rooftop tents and other accessories. On the bottom of every one of the racks are what we call the cross braces. And the cross braces run left to right across the vehicle. They have a T-slot in the bottom of them. They're a semi-elliptical design with a T-slot in there that allows us to attach what we call a feet in this uh, situation. So we have a, a K9 roof rack foot that mounts into our mounting rail. The mounting rail is designed to attach to the top of a roof rack or top of a roof in uh, the factory roof rack mounting points. So we attach this rail to the top of your roof. We add feet to that, and the feet come in 40 millimeter, 65, 80, and 90 millimeter heights. So we have some height adjustability there. And the feet mount to the platform. The next option is if your vehicle has gutter mounts, we have gutter mount legs. They attach to the bottom cross braces, just like the, the feet do, but these come down and tie into a gutter uh, system. The next option that we have is for specific uh, factory roof racks. We call this a G-clamp. This G-clamp will mount to a factory roof rack and attach a platform to it. So we have a wide variety of options depending on your application and need. I believe we can help you out. One of the ingenious things about the, uh, the K9 rack system is the T-slot system on the top of the rack. The slats that run from the front to the back of these roof racks in the center are all eight millimeter T-slots, but the perimeter is a six millimeter T-slot. And what's nice about that is that both the Yakima and Thule use six millimeter hardware in their track mounting system. So what that means that is that you can take all of your Yakima or Thule products, mount them to towers in the six millimeter T-slot here and use all of those products so they do not become obsolescent once you buy one of the K9 roof rack systems. Mount that all on the top of the rack without much problem at all. The trick of the matter is, is putting the six millimeter uh, hardware into the slot and getting attached to the bolts that come with the, with the Yakima or Thule set. Simple a matter of raising that nut up to where the bolt from the, from the Yakima or Thule product can uh, purchase that nut, tighten it down into place, add the bars, slide them back and forth where you need them, and you're off to the races. I'd like to take a minute to talk to you about the Easy On K9 Roof Rack uh, combination shovel and axe mount. It's a very nice uh, mount for mounting two pieces of equipment in one, uh, one place. This mount is designed to mount just in a horizontal position. It's not designed for vertical, so just horizontal. And it's very similar to our axe and shovel mounts in its design. It has the same knobs that, uh, that twist open, pop out of place, the latch comes up, gives you access for both of your tools, both shovel and axe mount. Both mount into place, put in position, slide over. These two clamps go into place, tighten into position. And once tight, it secures both of your implements in place, has a locking position to keep them safe and secure. The axe mount is designed to, uh, to set on the side of the K9 rack and provide a nice secure position for your axe. It's developed to mount to the uh, six millimeter T-slot on the edge of the rack in a vertical position here. The bracket itself uh, opens up with a twist here. Move that out of the way, open this up, your axe comes out.
It also comes with an axe cover for protection of the blade of your, of your axe. You put that back into place on the side of the rack, tighten this up, swing this down in position, close this tight so it holds the axe nice and secure in position so there's not much movement. It also has a lockable post here so that you, I can keep it safe and secure. The shovel mount is designed to mount to the side of the K9 roof rack system. It consists of a uh, roof rack accessory adapter that mounts into the six millimeter T-slot on the side of the roof rack, mated to the clamp that holds a shovel. If you undo this knob here, that loosens the bracket on the front. You open that up, your shovel comes out. To mount it back in, shovel goes back into position, clamp goes in place. This goes over the side, tightens in place right here. You also have a post with a hole designed to hold a lock so you can keep your shovel safe and secure. This mount can also be removed from the accessory adapter and used on any flat surface that you desire. The high lift mount that we have here is a great product to, uh, to secure your high lift to your roof rack. It can be mounted both in a horizontal fashion as well as a vertical fashion on the edge of the, of the K9 roof rack system. It consists of a rear mount here for the base of the uh, high lift as well as a clamp system for the center of the high lift. It allows you to take the, take the high lift off, put it back in on a post at the end, clamp down through here. This post comes in, secures it tightly. You also have a position here for a lock to keep it safe and secure. I'd like to talk to you for a minute about the EZON K9 roof rack Max Tracks mounts. It's an ingenious mount uh, that allows us to put our Max Tracks on top of the roof rack for easy removal and installation. Let's talk about them for a second. The mounts themselves are designed out of, uh, out of steel. They offset from the roof rack roughly two inches and provide some mounting points for the Max Tracks pins. So we take uh, four of the pins, mount them to the uh, to the, uh, the canine rack uh, mounting points, and it allows you to put the Max Tracks on the top of the roof rack. Either a pair of two or a set of four of the Max Tracks will work on there. The Max Tracks mounts are very nice in, because they have designed a T-slot system in the top of the mount that allows you to adjust the location of the Max Tracks mounts anywhere on top of the K9 rack system and put your Max Tracks on there. Let's put these back on here and I'll show you how that works. So you take your two, install them right on top of the pins that are mounted to the uh, K9 mounts, turn them into location, simple as that, lock them in place and you're good to go. We have both a single jerry can holder and a dual jerry can holder. Both have the same application, uh, holding either the, the NATO style or Wedco style metal jerry cans. And uh, it's an ingenious little uh, device here that allows you to mount it to the K9 roof rack system using our eight millimeter tie down points with several clamps. And these clamps are adjustable on uh, the front and the back of the jerry can holder so you can move it anywhere on the rack that you need to and, and mount it down. Plus what's really nice about these jerry can holders, not only are they very solid and sturdy and lockable, but when you take the jerry can out of this can holder, you can adjust the brackets down into the can holder itself, leaving you with about a two inch high bracket on the top of your roof when you're not carrying the jerry cans. There are no extra components to this jerry can holder that are stored separately when the cans are not in place. I wanna to talk to you for a minute about the EZON K9 40 liter water solution for the top of the K9 roof rack. The water solution here it shares the same footprint as the dual jerry can holder with a couple different uh, uh, changes on that solution. One difference here is the opening on the corner. Uh, the uh, opening for the water is on the corner here and they leave it without a, a hose or a tap or any of those items for you to choose what solution for getting the water off the roof rack is best for you. It's held in place with a ratchet strap that comes over and ties down back into the, uh, to the uh, tray itself. Uh, the tray shares the jerry can's mounting points 
which are clamps on the front and back of the tray, adjustable anywhere on the roof rack, two forward, two rearward, to hold the tray in place. It's a great solution for 40 liters or roughly 10 gallons of water. The accessory adapter is a uh, mount that is the female contour to the edge of the K9 roof rack system and mounts with two six millimeter bolts into the six millimeter T-slot on the side of the rack. What's nice about the accessory adapter is that now it creates a vertical surface for you to mount whatever you would like whether that is a, an awning, or in our case, uh, we mate them to our axe mount, our shovel mount, they're used in our high lift mount as well. We mount uh, brackets for the Series 1000 and 2000 awnings here, as well as the shade awning is an option to mount to this. Uh, an incredibly adaptable product. It's a universal product for us to use. Uh, take a look at this if you have an, an idea for something to mount to the side of a canine rack. This is the way to go. My name is Paul May. I'm with Equipped Expedition Outfitters. Thanks for watching.